Time for Don Pollock's world, who says the latest hobby rage is building a complicated contraption just to see if it can destroy or be destroyed. Hobby kits are something that people have enjoyed putting together for generations, but ironically, one of the most popular and fastest growing hobbies being featured at this weekend's uh, East Coast Hobby Show here at the Fort Washington Convention Center doesn't come with instructions, doesn't even come in a kit. The reason for the widely varying appearance of the radio-controlled model fighting machines built by members of the Northeast Robotics Club, who are forced to think outside the box since the parts they use don't come in one. Mostly we go to a Home Depot looking for parts that'll fit something that's on the inside of our skull. This was a wheel from a uh, Weber gas grill. It's hooked to a Black & Decker electric screwdriver by a radiator hose clamps. Surplus wheelchair motor I picked up online somewhere for $12. Half the stuff I get out of the restaurant supply store. All cobbled together to create a contraption that could easily be reduced to rubble by an opponent during the course of a bout inside the glassed-in ring. But that's all part of a hobby's appeal. When things start, parts start flying, we all start laughing. I just have a couple screws that need to be tightened. <laughs> I got a couple screws loose. <laughs> it's got everything. It's got destruction. It's got strategy. It's got engineering. Gadgets, toys, destroying things, building things, smashing things, blowing things up. When you're a kid, you get a remote control car for your, for Christmas. You know, you, you drive it nice for an hour, and then you and your brother smash them together and see what breaks. You know. We run three weight classes. We run one pound ant weights. We run 12 pounds, and there's 30 pounders. Obviously, the most important rules are safety. I mean, you don't want somebody getting killed by one of these things. You usually take your finger off, and you stick your hand in there, and I much left of it. We're all here for the same reason. We have a good time. You get something you've designed and built from the ground up. Anytime I'm out shopping, I've always got in the back of my mind, what can I use that for? A lot of it's modified remote control car stuff, and the rest of it's just, you know, straight out of the nether reaches of your imagination. And so the remote control, radio control, I mean, that's very much like this wireless microphone here, you know? Yeah, exactly like it, actually. From the Fort Washington Expo I Center. Need, I need to use that. I'm done. Oh, I can channel 6 Action News.